Oi? Yay! I think we're working now. Uh, can everyone let me know they can see me and hear me clearly? And then can we somewhere up here? Pin. So I think, yeah, it's working. Cool. Nine, Carl, how are we doing, mate? Let's just shift this camera a little bit. There we go. You're a fucking snood. Don't need this on Monday anyway. E. Thank you, Carl. I appreciate that for letting me know. Thank you, mate. Uh, I spoke to them a couple of other people that were in. Um, I feel I'll join in a minute now. Uh, that. Um, good, mate. Good. Good you're all right. Glad you're all right. Sorry. Uh, what have we got now? Right. Stop messing with me, people. Go away. <laughs> Ah, right, there we go. Cool. Uh, come on, let's have a couple more people in. Um, yes, thankfully it's the weekend now, Carl. Whoa. Good evening, Tom. How are you doing, mate? Don't know why. Some really odd, bizarre little moments for these live draws, to be honest. Like getting these up and running. <laughs> oh. I do apologise if you can hear a blue bottle. There's a blue bell there, blue bottle in the window. He's been pissing me off for the past hour. So if you do hear him, I do apologise. He'll be dead soon. Um, let's just get on that. Right, it's looking like this is all we're going to get in a minute. It's a bit shit. Uh, so that's in the house of views. Who's that seeing? But either way, because we're a little bit delayed, I should say we're probably not going to get many people in. But, right, anyway. So, as you can see here. Sorry, I'm looking at my own live draw. Um, there you are. Uh, so, as you guys can see on here, we have got another competition on there. A new one, which I haven't advertised yet. So, I literally just stuck it on like 20 minutes, I don't know, half an hour ago, something like that. Uh, this is a huge competition. Uh, we are just going to have a little quick click on this now and just go through what is on there. I suppose a muzzy stuck in your bivy oven. Let's wait for this to load up. Here we go. Mm, okay, so there you go. So we've got a huge competition here. This is a 19.99 ticket. Um, I put it on for a week. Obviously, if it sells out, then we'll do it before, of course. Um, I've stopped with all that. Uh, well, particularly on this one anyway, just because it's a huge competition, I'm not going to bother with doing that, all that July, May's, June's, whatever competition. Um, so I've just put this on as a straight uh, huge competition number one. Evening, Paul Briggs, how you doing, mate? I put this on for 19.99 ticket with 33 entries. Um, we've got some real good prizes to go out here. So there's some very similar ones. Um, this doesn't look great, but I'd rather be straight up and honest. Uh, we've got the Fox Frontier Bivy on there, but obviously because of its popularity at the minute, it sold out stupidly quick last time. Um, obviously, there's been a few more have now been released. Uh, but if it does, of course, sell out before we get this competition sold out, uh, obviously, if we get this sold out over the weekend, nine times out of ten, we're, well, nine, nine times out of a hundred, we're going to be fine for me to order this on Monday. And it'll still be in store, no problem. But obviously, if it takes longer, I've got to be prepared for that. And uh, we'll be able to get it on pre-order anyway if it's not available due to popularity. Uh, we've got three Delkin TXIDs plus the receiver. We've got the Fox RX 2 Rob Cross presentation. Evening, Johnny. Uh, we've got three Daiwa 20 Emblem 45 reels on there. We've got three Nashcope GT 4000s. Uh, there's two Shimano Bait Runner XTB CI4s. Uh, they're the medium-sized reels. We've also got the scopes on there at nine foot three pound. And then you've probably got Probably not far off, the, probably the best spod rod and reel you can get. We've got the Free Spirit E-Class Launcher, SPM, so spod and marker rod. 
uh, 13 foot uh, with the Shimano Ultegra XTD spod reel loaded with 30 pound braid and 200 pounds worth of bait, any brand. Uh, we've also got the Camo Bateman Acton Mark IV I sonar bait boat. If you ask Paul Briggs very nicely, I'm sure he'll give you a great review on that because he won the last huge competition and went for that Camo Boatman Acton bait boat. And then also we've got a cash prize on there for £475. Now, let's get off this because we're not actually drawing this tonight, but that is there uh, for the weekend. Fingers crossed we can actually draw that on Monday. Uh, what we are here to draw is July's second main competition. However, before that as well, we've also got July's fifth mini, which still got some tickets available. And we've also got July's first beginners competition as well. So if there is any mates of yours that won't get involved, um, start fishing. In, sorry to start fishing. Uh, give them a little poke, say, hey, look, there's this running on here for one ninety nine a ticket. You might get yourself, you know, some starter gear. Um, but anyway, second main, let's go on to that. So I'm going to click on this now. I will apologise if the computer's a little bit slow. It's um, uh, it's, it's a bit technical, but it's actually running its disk space. I don't know how to stop it from doing that. <laughs> right, so here we go. So this was a little change, this one. This was at £9.99 £9 a ticket. Uh, this had 30 entries on it, and this sold like hotcakes. Evening, Mike. How you doing, mate? Evening from Lakeside. Ah, well done, mate. Uh, where about see you out of curiosity? Um, so anyway, when this... So I'll have to use the mouse. I can't point and poker anymore, because no one can see this. Uh, right, so when you when this competition is active, obviously the minute it's sold out, so all this stuff has been blurred out. Normally this is filled with information here, where, me, where the mouse is. Uh, what you'll get here is you'll get a little number here with the quantity of tickets that you would like to purchase, so one, five, ten, whatever. Um, and then you also get a question and then a little drop down box with a load of answers in there. There's three answers, three answers to choose from. Obviously, one of them is correct. Uh, once you've done that, you'll have to cart, then you'll buy your tickets, etc. From there, once you've bought your tickets, all that information comes on to here for me. So here you can see first name, last name and the ticket number that you were allocated along with the answer that you gave. Everybody got the correct answer on here, so there's no issues there. From that, what we do is grab these first names and last names, and we head over onto, uh, so, oh no, never mind, it's gone now. I was gonna quickly try and apply to someone, but it's gone. Um, so from there, we copy, copy them names, then we come on to here, which is the fish race time. This is how we actually find out who our winner is. Normally, these are done with a number generator, etc., something like that. Uh, but we do something a little bit more exciting, which is the fish race. So we go on to names, and we clear the generic, generic one out, and we paste in the new one, which is everybody that entered. So 30 tickets there, so it's 30, down to number one at the bottom there. Click done. And then we add this on for 30 seconds. I've already knew with the speakers, because we all know the back soundtrack for this is horrendous. Uh, so this goes from 1 up to 30 there, but what we do is we actually shuffle these characters up. Uh, me and Michael, Harry are fishing Todber. Oh, I've got a couple of lads going to Todber in um, a couple of weeks, Michael. Um, hang on. See if we can get some uh, information out of you. <laughs> oh, where did I put it? I put it down somewhere, but I've got a couple of lads that are going to Todd, but they won one of the uh, competitions. So any information I'm sure he'll take. Uh, thank you, mate. Right, so we shuffled everybody up now. So as you can see now, we've got 50 in the bottom. There's 20 up at the top there. There's 12 in the middle, 30 down here at the bottom. But um, anyway, so from that, they're all ready. Them fish can sit there happily and wait for me for when we're ready. We're going to go back onto the competition page here, and we're going to go through exactly what we can win. So... At nine, sorry, this is July's second main competition at £9.99 a ticket with 30 entries. I'm glad you guys liked that, by the way. It was great to see it sell out quickly. Uh, there'll be one winner and one runner-up. The one winner will be able to pick one of these amazing prizes down below. The runner will receive a, I've put £4.99, which is not, it's actually, um, cancel that. We'll do, we'll do two runners-up at £4.99, so we'll do first, second, and third. Um, and then, then vouchers will come to you via email, uh, so keep an eye out on your inbox and your junk. Um, also, as, as, uh, as an added extra, if someone places first, second, and third in the fish race, we'll donate £50 to a charity of their choice. And this will be drawn now, today. So these are the prizes up for grabs. We have the Corda Singles in black. We've got the Fox Micron MX2 rod alarm set. We've got the Future Fishing Dial with custom cart rods, 10 foot, three and a quarter pound test scales, uh, three of them. 
With the Ridge Monkey Volt C Smart Wireless Power Pack, the 77,850 milliamps per hour. Uh, the Fox EOS 2 Man Bivy. We've got the Spiro XL Carry All with the, uh, all the, sorry. The Spiro XL Carry All slash Barra Bag, plus the Clip On Core Bag, Clip On Standard Bag, and the Buzzer Bar Bag. The Corda Compact 12 foot 3 Rod, plus the Small Carry All, cool, uh, Small Core Bag, and the uh, compact T-Set 3-piece. Uh, we've got the Fox Horizon Duo 3-rod in camo. We've got the Trapper Sanctuary bundle here, so you get the XL Sling, the Compact Oval Crib, and the T3 Land in there. We've also got the Trapper 365 sleeping bag, the Nash & Dulwich Compact Sleep System, which we're hopefully going to get a photo of on Monday, because Wayne Ward won that on Wednesday with the other main that we put on. Uh, we've got the Nash Titan Hide, we've got the Sonic Extractor 2-rod carp setup, so that's the 10-foot rods. Uh, three and a quarter pound test curves, two of them with two 6,000 FS reels and a 42 inch two piece landing there. Uh, got the Nash Bushwhacker, got the three Delcom EVDs, three Shimano Airlex 10,000 reels, Sabre Terrain Barra, the Nash, yeah, the Nash X Series 12 foot three and a half pound test curve rods, two of, uh, the Grace GT Distance Spot, sorry, the Grace GT Distance Marcus 12 foot six inch rod, plus Shimano Airlex spot reel loaded with braid. And two, oh, 200 pounds worth of base. Sorry, that was a real mouthful for me to get through, actually. I really struggled with that. Right, so they are all the prizes that you can win. We're going to go back onto our fish race now, where these beautiful little things have been waiting very patiently. So if you look in the bottom right-hand corner of your ski screen, you'll see it's nine, 10, pa sorry, 10 to 8, so 19.50. We're on the 16th of July. And in 3, 2... And one, we are going to start the race drawing sec uh, July 2nd main. They're off. So, who's going to take the lead for us then? So, we've got Thomas Beldam making the push there with ticket number 21, with Anthony Davis with ticket number 22 as well. There's a green fish there, but I can't see who's the name. There's 20 seconds left here. We're going to find out who it is. It's Robert Davis with ticket number six up there, joined in with Thomas Bell. So, the halfway mark, just, over, just past the halfway mark. So we've got Robert Davis in front with ticket number six and Thomas Bell in second place with ticket number 21. Ticket number nine now has just made a push with Paul Briggs out in front with three seconds to go. It's Paul Briggs out in front with ticket number nine. Followed in with in second place. I think that's also Paul Briggs with ticket number 27. We're going to have a little look now, see what it says. There he is. So we've got Paul Briggs with ticket number nine. Congratulations. You are our winner of July's second main competition. Uh, you've also got the runners-up spot with ticket number 27. That'll get you a £4.99 voucher. And then in third place, we've got Robert Davis uh, with ticket number two, where, again, you will get a £4.99 voucher as well. So let me go back on Google Sheets. And this is just for me. Go on. There we go. Paul Briggs, ticket number nine. And then we've got 27 and two, which are our runners-up. So I'm going to start on two. I'm going to scroll down to ticket number 27. God, this is really quite buggy and slow. Get ready to go off our fish race. Right. So, unfortunately, that is all we've got to draw tonight. I do apologise, guys, but that's all we've got. Um, so, that was July's second main competition where Paul Briggs won with ticket number nine. Um, and then in second place, we've got Robert Davis with ticket number two, who's got a £4.99. Sorry, he came third, actually. Let me try that again. July's second main competition was won by Paul Briggs with ticket number nine. And in second place was Paul Briggs with ticket number 27. In third place was Robert Davis with ticket number two. Now, the second and third place have both got themselves a £4.99 voucher to be spent on future competitions they're liking. Keep an eye out on your mail, on your inbox and your junk. Uh, so as I stated at the beginning of the live draw, we do have a huge competition that is available. That is at the expensive price of £19.99p. However... Due to the odds, it's a very, very good price. Um, so have a little look on there, guys. If there's anything that you fancy, if there's nothing on there that you fancy, there's always cash as well. Um, so uh, yes, yeah, so there's, there's, there's a little bit of something there for everybody, I believe. We've got. It would have been nice to get a few more bivvies on there and rods, etc. But unfortunately, that's all I could get on there at, the, at this time being. But there's still some very good prizes on there. Some very good bite lines to be gone at. Um, of course, there's the Fox Frontier bivvy. And some amazing reels as well. And even so, if that doesn't tickle your pickle, you've got the cash on there as well. So thank you, everybody, for taking the time out to watch the live draw. Um, my name is Jack from Fishing Gear Competitions. I'd like to thank you all. So catch you guys later. The next live draw will be on Monday, where hopefully we can draw that huge competition.
as well as uh, potentially the mini that's on there and the beginners competition as well. So thank you, everybody, and I'll see you guys Monday. Bye-bye-bye. Where do I end the live draw? It's here.